Let's talk about Instagram and how you, as a lawyer, can use it to grow your practice. I'm Nicole Abood, lawyer, podcaster, and owner of Abood Media, a company focused on helping lawyers build more valuable relationships with current and potential clients using many of the tools available to us online, like videos and social media. All right, let's dive in. But first, why Instagram? Instagram is too big of a platform to ignore. As of the time of the recording of this video, Instagram is reported to have 500 million monthly active users. What are the chances that some of those users could be potential clients for you? They're pretty good, I would say. So think of the untapped marketing potential. So many opportunities for building relationships with others. It's so exciting. And with Instagram adding Instagram Stories, uh, the Instagram Stories feature, now there's even more reason to use Instagram for your law practice. I'll record a future video just on Instagram Stories for lawyers, but for now, let's focus on the basic Instagram picture sharing feature. So here are some of my favorite tips on how to do it correctly. Tip number one, tell a story. Tell the story of your law firm. Tell the story of your lawyers, your associates, and staff members. Tell the story of how you provide value and help your clients. Tell the story of your law firm culture. Tell us all these stories in pictures. How? Just post behind the scene images of you and your associates grinding away at the office. <laughs> Highlight new associates or super staff members you employ. Snap a picture before you enter a courthouse for a hearing. Think of the way you want followers to feel about you as a lawyer when they see your picture and try to capture those feelings in pictures. Tip number two, try to pick a theme and stick to it. Your Instagram account should be visually appealing and cohesive. After all, it's very visually driven, so you have to make sure you're posting fun, relevant, uh, and exciting images worthy of a double tap. One tip is to pick a color, a font, a filter, maybe a certain way of cropping your pictures and sticking to it. This will be your theme, and you should, align, you should aim to align all your images with your theme. Tip number three, share legal tips, not advice. You've got all that legal knowledge. Think of how helpful it would be if you shared it in bite sizes. Now create some attractive images to, to go along with those legal tips. Of course, always be mindful of not crossing into that legal advice territory, but if you keep it educational, you should be fine. Tip number four, use the caption space wisely. Use the caption space under the picture to include a captivating caption uh, or description that relates to the image that you just posted. Pose a question for your followers to answer. When followers comment, respond. Get that conversation going. And you should aim to always be the last comment on any given post. Leave no followers comment unanswered. And don't forget those hashtags. Using relevant hashtags to help potential clients and followers find you in a post is very important. Tip number five, post regularly. Creating a posting schedule and sticking to it is important. And I realize that lawyers are busy. For many lawyers, they actually really enjoy handling their own social media accounts. But for many others, they'd rather outsource to social media management companies. Either way, you can't go wrong as long as you have a schedule and you're sticking to it on Instagram and showing up consistently. So to wrap it all up, Instagram is a great platform to humanize your law firm. Just like with any social media platform, it's up to you to decide if it's the right platform for you and your practice. And if you decide it is, considering maybe that's where your ideal client and customer exists, then be sure to refer to these tips to make your presence on Instagram known and to get the most out of your time spent on the platform. Oh, and of course, don't forget to follow us on Instagram at Abood Media for daily content marketing tips or my personal account at Nick underscore Abood. And of course, I would love for you to subscribe to this channel if you haven't already done so. And be a good friend. Share this out with another lawyer friend who you think would benefit from watching. All right. Thank you all. Catch you next time.